上述之路，乃生死轮回之路，不能脱无生死之苦。点传师点开玄关正门，这是通天之路，我们不必再走四门，不必再坠入轮回受苦。但是，我们必须要真修，否则玄关虽开，我们的灵性仍能返天。因我们还是充满罪恶，灵性为罪恶所是不能自由从正门而出的。In the Bible, Matthew 14:11, John said to his disciples, "I baptize you with water to show that you have repented, but that one who will come after me will baptize you with the Holy Spirit and fire." The Tao is transmitted to you in the temple of God through God as sanction and commandment. The holy lamp on the altar symbolizes God. In the transmittal ritual, the teacher uses the incense to lead a line of fire from the holy lamp to your heavenly portal. Then, using his finger, he connects God as spirit with your spirit so that they flow together as one. Thereby enlightening you with God as Spirit. This is the actual fulfillment of John as prophecy. Five. 圣经上记载，约翰对他的门徒说：“我用水给你们施洗，表明你们已悔改。”然而，在我之后的将用圣灵与火给你们施洗。请记忆，你们是在上帝的宫殿里得到，因为我们有上帝的天命。那盏佛灯代表上帝老，在点到之仪式中，你们已见到点传师已相助，从佛灯引来一条金指向你们的玄关。然后借点传师的手指点在你们的玄关之时，上帝以一的圣灵已点开了你们的心窍，照破了黑暗。现在你们可见到约翰之预言已经实现在你们身上。Sakyamuni Buddha said, "I had the great Dharma which is hidden in the eyes. This indicates the location of the heavenly portal." Six. 释迦牟尼佛云：“无有正法，掩藏此语，暗示玄关之地。” Be the second treasure, the divine mantra one. You have now been given the divine mantra. It is very important to remember it, as it will save your life. It is only to be used in extremely dangerous situations. This mantra acts as a powerful spiritual distress signal to the divine forces, much like an SOS transmitted by radio waves. It is to be projected mentally and silently with great concentration, while at the same time focusing the eyes on the heavenly portal and holding the symbolic seal with the hands. Powerful aid will immediately be sent to you in order to rescue you from danger. If you sincerely cultivate yourself. You will always remain under the refuge of Buddha. 二第二宝口诀：心经或五字真经，一刚才传授口诀给你们，还记得吗？请再说一遍。当性命危险时，你才用此宝，将真经默念口中，手抱合同。你将可被天佛救护，脱离危险。
不过要注意此后觉竟能于性命为及支持方和运用。假若我们真诚修道。当然，我们将受天国之庇佑。二点 ，The divine mantra which connects your true self with God. This mantra is without form, sound or color, and is the essence of Tao, the underlying and ultimate principle of the universe. This mantra unites your being with that of the Tao, forming a powerful bond. Every great religion indicates this potential unity, but they do not fully understand how to implement and effect it. You now have this knowledge and are familiar with its application. 二心经。口传心受由声音而达入无声音我之真心，由千经万点而达入真经真点，心经心法真空也真我本气也。三点 ，The true teaching is transmitted from mind to mind. The true self, the I, the spirit. The mind all indicate the true center of man or his real essence and original indestructible nature, which is identical with Tao. The human being is a microcosm, sharing all the attributes of the macrocosm. Since he is essentially divine, man only needs. To understand the nature of reality and align himself with it, the more pure and refined his nature, the more conscious he becomes of his relationship with the Tao. When he realizes that he is one with the Tao, he has become fully enlightened. 三以心传，心口传，心手。以老之心传于众生之真心，此者老的分灵之心也。C. The third treasure, the symbolic seal one. In Chinese, pa means to combine and dun means all together. The symbolic seal, which is formed by the two hands joined together, is the golden seal, which is formed by the two hands joined together, is the golden seal, which unites us with God. It is like a contract or mutual agreement, which is the actual meaning of hatun between you and your heavenly mother. It acts as a signal, password. Or passport. It is a spiritual instrument of identification, as well as symbolic ramifications. Two. When you hold the symbolic seal, you are united with God. Three. The left hand is good, so it is placed on the outside, covering the right hand. The right hand is often used for evil purposes, such as beating and killing. The right hand is placed on the inside because of its evil propensities and is shielded by the left hand. Together, the hands hold the word "child," which is formed by the two thumbs in proximity, symbolizing the Chinese word "hai," which means "child." This hand symbol acts as a direct signal to God. It serves to mobilize heavenly protection and causes the user to escape from any impending calamity. Four. Let us quote some words from the Bible, Matthew 19:13 to 15. Some people brought children to Jesus for him to place his hands on and to pray for them, but the disciples scolded the people. Jesus said, "Let the children come to me and do not stop them." 
because the kingdom of heaven belongs to them. He placed his hands on them and then went away. This event illustrates the power and significance of the symbolic seal. At that time Jesus placed his hands on the children's heads and explained that this is the way to God's kingdom. Today we hold the child symbol and realize that we are the children of God and are willing to return to God's presence. 三第三保和同一点和同之意和是和成一体同是相同和同象征老赐于我们的经印表示我们以归根人我们守报和